one should not always call themselves an ally. That should be a title that's granted to you because others see the work that you're constantly and consistently doing. Really have to do is be comfortable being uncomfortable and like take the risk of, you know, it's like jumping into an unlit pool or a lake at night, right? You don't know how deep it is, you don't know what, but you just gotta go all in and you gotta jump. To that aspect of sacrifice, which I think is the hardest part for, um, for so many as we talk about allyship and the idea of, you know, standing down um, to create opportunity for someone else to rise up is, you know, is so key. And I know that, you know, people think, oh, well, you know, by me being an ally, I don't know if I want to be an ally because then I have to make room at the table. But the thing is, when you add to the table, the table only gets bigger. Mm -hmm. It doesn't get smaller. Look, I think it's awesome that companies are spending $100 million in donating to Black Lives Matter, but I said they need to spend another $100 million internally changing things. I don't think it should be one or the other. I think they should do both, right?